unit value of transformer 1 is the old per unit value which is 0 0.08 multiplied by the new per unit MVA the new base MVA is 15 and the old base is 20 from the graph showed here multiplied by the 66 kV which is the old uh, MVA on the you can take this one this one can be taken as the secondary side or the primary side if you take the secondary side voltage which is the 66 kV of the transformer you have to take the base value on the secondary side which is on this transmission line it's the same 66 kV or if you want to take it from the primary side it's 6.6 .6 as here and the base value is also 6.6 .6. so there is no different and the value of this one will be J point zero six per unit while the per unit value of transformer two is the same as this one this is for transformer two what about the per unit value of the transmission line in the transmission line they already gave us the ohmic value not the per unit value thus we can take we will add it immediately 60 ohm which is the actual value multiplied by the base in VA which is 15 over the base voltage 66 squared and this will give us J point Zero, uh, two, zero 0207 per unit now I will find the per unit reactance of the motor 1 and 2 and uh, which is the old per unit reactance which is 0.2 per unit multiplied by the MVA of the electric motor which is uh, equal to 6 MVA so it's 15 the old over the new the new over the old sorry the new over the old MVA multiplied by the square of the voltages which is the vo the old voltage which is 6.6 .6 over the new voltage base which is 6.6 .6. and this will gives me J.06 per unit thus we will add these values on the reactance diagram above so it's uh, 0.6 per unit so the generator new uh, per unit value is as the old one 0.12 the transformer per unit reactance is J.06 and this is J.207 this is J.06 this is J.6 and this is also J.6 and this is the answer this is example number 4 it's the the one line diagram of an unloaded generators is shown uh, below here this figure draw the periodic impedance
reference diagram choose a base of of 50 MVA 13.8 kV and generator circuit number one so the base quantities that the is given here is 50 MVA for all the system and the voltage that the base voltage given is on the generator bus here thus we will transfer this voltage here and from here to here and then from here to here to find the base voltage in each part of the this system each component has its name uh, the values in the, its name plate generator 1 it has 20 MVA and the voltage 13.8 kV and the percentage reactance is the percentage reactance yes is uh, 0.2 per unit and the rest of the system is shown in the figure the solution is as follows the base MVA or the apparent power is 50 MVA while uh, the base voltage on generator number 1 is 13.8 KV the voltage base on transmission line I will uh, note the, uh, this transmission line number one and number one the base voltage is the 13.8 which is the base value on the generator number one bus multiplied by the uh, secondary of the transformer number one which is 220 kV over the primary of the transformer number one which is 13.8 kV thus the voltage base on the transmission line is 220 kV Now, the base voltage on generator number 2 is the base voltage of the transmission line multiplied by the primary, the secondary side, the primary side of the, of, uh, the secondary side of the transformer number 2, this one, which is here written. 127 kV over 18 kV thus it will be 18 kV over 127 kV multiplied by the root 3 since this is a single phase a three single phase units it's a three single phase unit thus this is the voltage per phase to change it into line we multiply it by root 3 thus it will give us 18 kV the base voltage on generator bus number 3 is the 220 kV multiplied by the 22 kV over 220 kV thus it's uh, a tw 22 kV kilovolt on the bus of the trans of the trans of the uh, generator number 3 now we will find the per unit reactance of each component of this system that's the per unit of the synchronous reactance of generator number one 
will be 0.2 the old per unit value multiplied by the new NVA which is 50 over the old NVA the old NVA is uh, 20 NVA multiplied by the square of the voltage bases the voltage base old one which is 13.8 over the new one 13.8 and this will give us 0.5 g.5 per unit now the per unit value of transformer 1 it's the old per unit value which is here in percentage 10% means 0.1 Thus it will be 0.1 multiplied by 50 over over 25 MVA multiplied by the primary voltage base which is 13.8 this is the new the old over the new squared and it gives us J.2 per unit now the per unit value of transmission line number 1 and here the ohmic value are given I will indicate that this is 1 and this is 2 and this is 3 number 1 is J80 for transmission line number 1 J80 multiplied by the base MVA 50 over the base voltage which is 220 squared and this will yield J.083 per unit experience transmission line number 2 it's J100 multiplied by 50 over 220 squared and this 0 0.1033 per unit X per unit transmission line number 3 J50 multiplied by 50 over 220 squared it's J.05116 per unit now X per unit of transformer number 2 the old per unit value which is 10% it's 0.1 per unit multiplied by the old the new MVA over the old the old MVA is given 10 MVA for each single face for a 3 face we multiply it by 3 it means it's 30 MVA this will be 50 over 30 MVA multiplied by the 220 let's take the secondary the primary of this transformer 220 over 220 squared J.1667 per unit X per unit transformer number 3 it's the 10% which is 0 0.1 multiplied by 50 over 30 multiplied by 222 
220 kV or 220 kV square and this will give us the value J.143 per unit now X for generator number 2 for generator number 2 it's a 30 MVA and 18 kV base these are the old and the old per unit is 0 0.2 while the base value of generator number 2 is 18 the same now we will put the 0.2 old per unit value 50 over 30 multiplied by 18 over 18 squared the new over the old or the old over the new which is equal J.333 per unit now for generator number 3 for generator number 3 there is a different value in the voltage it has a 30 MVA base and a 22 kV base these are the old value and the old value on value is 0.2 but the voltage base on generator number there is a mistake here it's 20 so the old one is 20 and the new base is 22 now let's put the values it's j.2 multiplied by 50 over 30 multiplied by the old which is 20 over the new which is 22 squared and this will give us 0.275 per unit also for transformer number 3 the MVA is, is the 35 check this out so it's uh, 35 here and check the answer also now to draw the the, the reactance diagram for this circuit so this is the reactance diagram I just uh, rewrite it on its simplified equivalent circuit which represent each component by its own periodic reactance and then just plug in uh, put in the values of each uh, component that we, uh, we uh, already calculated before